hello welcome to just frame as part of this video we are going to see how to integrate github copilot into eclipse nowadays we can see the github copilot is using almost everywhere in the software industry development in terms of writing boiler code page or debugging your code fixing the issues or generating the documentation or writing the JUnits. so we are using many places so officially github copilot is not given any plugin directly for Eclipse but we have a one of the third party plugin we can install or we can configure in our Eclipse and we can use it there is no issue in that so we are going to see how to install this github copilot plugin in our Eclipse and how to configure it and then how to use it so that we are going to see it so let's get started so to install any plugin in Eclipse so we need to go to the help and you can see Eclipse marketplace then it will open a pop-up window you can type here yeah so we need to type here co pilot for Eclipse and then press enter so you will be getting a plugin so we can see over here so currently the plugin version is 1.3.2 so if you want to see the more information we can see over here and if you want to see the some of the it's currently it's a free version we can use it but to use this plugin in your eclipse you should have a proper github copilot account so which need to be installed so for right now to install this one you can do install this plugin and it will take a moment so once installation is done so we need to activate this account meaning so we need to activate your account or we need to link your account to your eclipse such a way that eclipse can connect to your github copilot account then it will try to fetch the solutions for you so now we can finish it it is trying to install this software we can see over here it will take a moment so the plugin is need to be downloaded need to be installed in your Eclipse so once this plugin is downloaded com completely we can see a github copilot icon over here and also we can see a pilot one more menu you will be getting here so now right now we can see so the installation is down it will ask you to restart your Eclipse let me restart it And also this plugin will be supported most of the I mean, Eclipse versions like 4.23 so one of the basic version like 4.28 onwards it will support 4.35 the latest version so 4.28 in the sense like 2023-06 version onwards it's supporting till latest version so basically it is supporting almost all versions now we can see there is a two more icons it got added three we can see one is here there is a github copilot sign in is required and you can see there is a copilot menu and we can see there is a copilot chart okay so these are the three icons which got added okay so now what we have to do if we first we need to activate your license account into our eclipse for that purpose we just click over here then it will say sign into github copilot so before this one you should have a proper licensed account it could be a free version or any valid version of account it need to be installed so for this correction and you click on that you will be getting a pop-up so you can click on this button copy code and open then it will try to open in case if you don't have an account you need to log in into github account so right now i have already logged in so it is showing me directly and then continue then we need to paste the code which is copied and then continue and then authorize github copilot plugin then it is saying congratulations you are all set to done so now come back to your eclipse so still it is trying to authorization is done now we can see you have successfully signed into authorized github copilot access now we can say okay 
so now you can come back over here and you can check so it's saying that status copilot is ready so it's saying this is the user just prime and connection is okay and you can click on okay so that means so the communication is ready and we can see now this panel is enabled so how we are going to use it so how we are going to verify the really the plugin got installed and it's working so let me write a simple java class i'm going to write a simple java class called calculator so this is a simple class i'm just trying to write and finish it so now this is a calculator class so inside that what i want to do i want to write a, a simple method which will take so i'm not writing anything here but still eclipse is suggesting here you can see there is add method is suggesting and there is subtract method it is suggesting now i want to write multiply so let me type it public int multiply if you come back here right so i just type multiply and it is trying to understand you are trying to write a calculator class and in general in calculator we can see add subtract multiply so if you want to take it this suggestion you can press tab and then it will be ready to use it and you can save it so that means it is generating a lot of codes by just seeing your class pattern so this means the plugin is working now let me ask you to generate a documentation so how to use it right click select the code and you can see so there is an option you can see over here a github copilot for eclipse and you can see there is a menu will be coming over here so what you are expecting here you want to generate any documentation you can ask for it it will generate a documentation and before applying the documentation documentation to your real code you want to see it so you can come back over here you can see the documentation for multiply method how it got generated and when you want to apply it so there is a two buttons over here you can copy or you can apply directly so i am let just right want to apply directly so you can see over here so the documentation is generated very nicely and then you can save it now let me generate a simple one public boolean is is palindrome so basically I just I'm just trying to type a string method which is some of the generic methods palindrome even or not so it is trying to give the code to us directly so that means it's working and again if you want to generate anything documentation or anything you can go to github copilot and if you want to explain this one if you want to know if you want to know how this is working what is this code you just type and it is trying to explain the code for you So it's just trying to explain here. So you can see over here what is generating, what this string method will do, what is this reverse will do, it's a palindrome. So all those things it is trying to explain to you in a documentation. So that means it's working. So this is the way you can add the plugin and you can use it in your eclipse. Okay. I think that's all about this video. If you like the video, you can subscribe to the channel for more subsequent updates. Thank you.